The house isn't far away now. We only have to go down that block and go through that dark alley. We will make it out. Kumunde. Okay. Thanks again for the little talk. You didn't need to tell me that if it was going to make you sadder. It's okay, honey. You did good yourself. Running away was a bad idea, but at least we know that you are safe and that's all that matters. Thanks, grandmother, and I love you. I love you too, Scott. Now let's get out of this bus stop and move on back to your house. Your home is around the corner, Scott. You guys are going to make it. Do you hear that? It is getting louder. We better hurry out now. Let's go. I can't move. I am so scared right now. You have to make it. Let's go. Those are gunshots. We need to get out of here now, Scott. Well, if it isn't the old granny in the shoe. I must say, you look pretty tough, or not tough enough. You must really want to help your grandson, don't you? Please don't hurt me, sir. I come in peace and I just need to get out of here. Please just let me be and then we will all live happily ever after. Of course I'll live happily ever after. But not you. I heard gunshots in here and I came as fast as I can. What happened? Grandmother Joy has, has, died from a pumpkin-headed freak. We need to get out of here before the same thing happens to us. I think he's after me. Let's go. I seem to believe this happened to my great friend. I consider her my friend. Let's go. 